Hi, I'm really excited because I'm coming to London and I'll be conducting a full day workshop and I hope that you'll attend. One of the things I love about conducting full day workshops is that it gives me an opportunity to connect with you. It gives me time so that we can actually get to know each other and so that we can actually have some fun. It's a lot more relaxing doing a full day workshop than it is to do one of my keynotes, one of my 90 minute speeches. So this is gonna be pretty special and I really do hope you'll join me because we'll talk about all kinds of things, especially about the challenges that we face. You know, most of you who've read my book or even who read other self-help books, you probably know already the importance of loving yourself. But yet, so many of you have written to me to say, you know it's important to love yourself, but yet you find it challenging to put into practice. One of the reasons why it's challenging is because it's not the dominant way that most people around you think. And we're still afraid that when we love ourselves or show that we love ourselves publicly, people are gonna judge us. This is why it's so difficult to put it into practice. So we're gonna talk about processes and methods of how we can put it into practice. We're gonna talk about practical exercises and I'm gonna give you tools, not just about loving ourselves, but about all kinds of other things. We're gonna talk about connecting with our bodies, how to deal with discomfort, how to deal with illnesses, grieving, bereavement, all kinds of things like that. So I really do hope you will join me because I promise it will be a day of fun, laughter, and also there'll be a lot of learning. So I do hope you will join me. It's five weeks from now. I'm getting excited, only five weeks away. I hope you'll join me for my workshop and all you have to do is click on the link below for more information on the things that I'm going to talk about. And also you'll find information on how to book your seats. So I'll see you then.